So today, we're gonna take our 2021 F-150 and see if it can pull that trailer. Stick around, let's see if this is gonna get stupid. So right now, the trailer's not hooked up. That's about the gap that we have. So let's see, after we get this thing hooked up, how much it actually squats. So now we're all hooked up. We got our seven pin connected, got our safety chains on. You see it's squatted some. Doesn't look like it's squatted too bad. So we're gonna put her in four wheel drive and make sure we get out of this field. We're conventional. So we got our locked, we're connected. Safety chains are done. This one doesn't have a breakaway. But this checklist is part of the trailer light check. So let's do this. Then we're going to start. Now we're going to go look at our lights. Now the lights are on. Then we got one turn signal. We got the other turn signal. Then we got brakes. So we're good. And then we'll head to the cat scale. Come on, let's go. on this truck it's a 2021 f-150 uh, stx so it is an xl by the stx package this has the five liter v8 which is right at i think 400 horsepower and 410 foot pound of torque and it's got a 355 rear gear and it's four wheel drive so so far it's doing good like i said you can definitely feel it back there uh, we're certainly not breaking any uh, speed records. Uh, I think if I had a weight distribution hitch, it would probably fare better. Uh, probably wouldn't squat as much and take some of the sway out a little bit, but it's really not that bad. So we're just going to keep on digging down the road here and uh, we'll get back to you as soon as we get to the Catskill. All right, so we're just going to take a quick stop. This trailer hasn't been moved in years. We're going to just look at the tires, kind of touch them, make sure the temperature is not going crazy. So far, so good. All right, so as you can see here in the video, this is what it weighs. Uh, I was a little surprised that the trailer wasn't quite as heavy, but uh, we're definitely overloaded on the axle. I just assumed that however Rick's got this thing loaded in the trailer that the tongue weighs pretty heavy. Uh, I think going forward as far as what um, travel trailer we're probably gonna get, um, I think seven to 8,000 pounds will be fine. I know that tongue weight will be a whole lot lighter. So uh, yeah, I think this is uh, a good outing to kind of see what the capabilities of this F-150 is. Alright, so we just got done with the scales for the second time to weigh the truck with nothing on it so I can compare how much it weighed with the trailer, tongue weight, how much was on the hitch, and all of that. So, give me a minute here, and we'll check out all the numbers. Okay, so we uh, we got the numbers. The numbers are in. So, Rick's trailer, as I suspected, was heavier than I thought. Uh, it was about 9,300 pounds, give or take. I'll, I'll throw up all the specs here on the side. 
but uh, we were about 21, 2200 pounds on the ton weight, which is really overloaded for our rear axle. Uh, our truck weighs roughly 5,500 pounds, and our uh, GVCW, our gross vehicle combined weight, uh, is only just a little over 7,000 pounds. So with the ton weight, how much the truck weighs, uh, we were definitely overloaded on the rear axle. I believe the rear axle is only uh, rated for like 3,400 pounds, and we were like 4,400 pounds. So all in all, a decent test for this truck, even though we were overloaded, but it gives me more confidence in whatever travel trailer that we're going to get that uh, we know that this truck is more than capable. Like the one that we're really thinking about getting, the uh, 2023 Rockwood um, 2614 RV. You know, we just did a video, uh, I'll put the link there in the corner. Um, that one we really like. All the weights are within spec. Um, so this truck would more than carry that travel trailer so what do you guys think uh, let me know in the comments below let me know what kind of truck you got uh, how much weight you're pulling so uh, like subscribe leave some comments and I'll talk to you guys in the next one Bye.